He'll paint your noose like an old man He's got you thinking about your death and you are frightened To everyone, I'm Ada from Poison Rock, and today we have the huge honor to have with us Sami from Creator. Hi, Sami. First of all, how are you? Hi, Ada. I'm doing very well. I'm over here in Essen at the moment. Usually, I live in Helsinki, but over here for rehearsals, and it's a beautiful summer day over here. And how are you? I'm fine. Actually, here it's raining in Sicily. Mm -hmm. There is the opposite thing, suppose raining in Germany and being the sunny in Sicily, but today maybe there is a little bit of a change of the weather at the time. So, before speaking about Creator, I wanted to ask you if you, you can speak a little bit of your experience in Valtari. <laughs> oh, well that's a very, very, very long story, because that started from... Yeah, all well, the time you need <laughs> one. <laughs> that, that started a long time ago when I was 17 years old oh. in Helsinki and, and uh, that's when I basically started doing gigs and making albums and so on and uh, we made our debut album in 1991 which is a terribly long time ago. I we was even... four years ago, I was a child. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, well I was, I was 19 so <laughs> and uh, <coughs> Back then, we just with the band, we decided to move to Berlin because we got one gig over there, just packed our stuff in a van and uh, just decided to uh, move over and check if we can book some more shows. And um, uh, that's how it all started, basically, the international career with Walt. I mean, it's such a long time ago, but I'm, I'm happy that the band is still continuing. I'm not anymore in the live lineup, there's, there's a younger generation that has taken <laughs> over, <laughs> but um, on the last album I was co-writing a couple of songs and, oh, and really? played, played, a, played a few songs also, like, so we had four guitarists playing on the album, because it's more, it's more like, a, how should I say, um, like, a, like a community more That's than a band amazing. these days. Yeah, a yeah. project, a project, um, a family. Well, well, uh, I'd say family, yeah. Family is a good word. That's amazing. Mm. So, you uh, joined Creator with uh, Violent, Re Violent Revolution. You think that joining the band in that moment could have uh, in some way like, an impact in, to the sound, in the sound of the band, change something in the sound of the band when you join? Well, we're only four guys in Creator, so if one steps out, it's like one fourth changes, I suppose. I mean, <laughs> isn't, isn't that the way it goes? And uh, it was a kind of a moment where Mille and Yule and the rest of the band, they wanted to make a little bit of a change to a more like harder direction, back to a harder direction after a kind of yeah. a, a experimental adventure in the Gothic realm for one album. So for me, it was the exactly the right time to join the band because I thought that exactly is what Creator does is at its best at, and um, I was I was very happy to join. So for the first album, I really only went directly to the studio and was more or less decorating it, so that it was the second album that I was doing with them. For me, the second album, Enemy of God, that I was more like really uh, it's, involved. Uh, it's like one of the Bible of thrash metal. Uh, Oh, come on. Well, thank you very much. But that was more when I became more involved in the band. So yes. The, the first first album I was merely decorating. <laughs> yeah, it was the it was the begin it was the beginning. We can say, just yes. getting in the feeling and in touch with them. So, how is your relationship with uh, Mila Petrosa, which is one of the founder of the band together with Jurgen uh, Ray Bento? Is right. Is <laughs> right because I don't. I have some problem with Germany. <laughs> That's fine, so do I. <laughs> but, I mean, the, the feeling in the band is really good at the moment. And I'm, I'm here in Essen right now, where we're uh, writing, arranging and uh, recording demos for the, for the next album, 
which is a lot of fun and the mood is great. We also have a new man on the bass guitar called Frédéric Leclerc. Uh, uh, from, 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 uh, yes, <laughs> and and uh, and the general vibe and the atmosphere is, is very good, very good. And That's the, a matter very, of the year. Very, Yes, yeah, so creative times for creator at the moment. <laughs> Amazing. And how, I mean, your way of composing brings to the band new ideas? Well, uh, the main composer for creator is for sure Miller. And uh, yeah. but and then he likes likes to send us some demos over, but then 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 we all arrange them together and bring it new ideas to it and and try to uh, yeah enhance them and sometimes bring our own ideas of course as well and and uh, yeah that's what that's what we're doing right now and just try to make the best possible results that imaginable because we are uh, really want to work hard on the next album so that's so. amazing oh, well. that's amazing you have released five album with them which is your favorite album that you released with them and why <laughs> well, why also? <laughs> well, uh, as a musician, you know, you, you always try to give your best when you're recording it. Yeah. And and then you listen to them a lot during the demo <laughs> stage, the, the recording stage. And then after when it's that done, you kind of let it go away from your hands and uh, uh, start performing some of the songs live, of course. But then I don't really listen to them that much yeah. after 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 this time because it's it's uh, so it's hard to say for for me it's always the newest one the newest one is yeah. like always always the favorite because it's the closest to the heart at the moment and and the emotions that you feel are are right there so yeah I so i i'd like to say the next one <laughs> the next one yeah that's a, that's great that's a good answer and um I mean, before you joining them, their music was um, the music influenced your way of composing. I mean, before you joined them, their music influenced your way of composing, even if you weren't in the band. Uh, if I was composing for somebody else, you mean, or what is yeah. the question? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Even, yeah, yeah. Mm, uh, a, a little bit, a little bit, but in my other bands, like, like for example, Valtteri. Kertsu, the singer, he's he's very productive, and he like, like, he writes songs all the time. He like, shits them out of his ass all the time, gener like, constantly. And also with my other band, Barren Earth, it's it's there's mm -hmm. a there's a Opulaine, the the bass player. He plays in Amorphis too, so he's like the main composer. But 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 in that band, everybody composes too. And uh, and and Mille, Mille is the main songwriter in in uh, in Creator, so I've I've always been lucky lucky enough to be surrounded by very very creative songwriters, but who also give me space to to uh, be creative in my own Bring way as well. Your, your own, and, your yes, own exactly. yes, exactly. And uh, and with, with all the bands that I've been playing, like Key Cobra Band, there, there's also uh, also a main songwriter. It's not me, and uh, and yeah, yeah. I, I I but I believe I bring a lot to the music myself. Yeah, also. that's amazing. And, 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 mm -hmm. and what do you think about Creator since their beginning? And what you, what did you like most of their sound before you joined them? <laughs> well. I remember when I was a kid, like a teenager. Really? It was the first, first time I actually heard uh, albums like Extreme Aggression and so on. I, I heard them through a drummer, through the drummer of Valtteri, actually, who Jan ah. later was in, was in the band. And uh, I liked it a lot, especially the energy, the raw energy and, and the, yeah. every, everything that comes with it. So um, yeah, and and when they asked me to join, I was I felt like uh, very privileged, and, and well, yeah, I'm gonna do this, and and look at me as still doing it after 20 years. <laughs> yes, in fact, it's amazing. It's amazing. <laughs> as I was saying before to you, rumors say that soon could be a return of Creator. Is that true? Yes, it is. Yes, it is. I wish that the timetables would be more clear because of these COVID times and so on. But also, it gives yeah. us a chance 
but it's also giving us a chance to reinvent ourselves and, and make right. make make the best music possible and and give it all we got you know so it will be like a surprise we will have a, fun, a lot of surprise yes 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 uh, but um, there is a tour coming up for sure in 2021 with Lamb of God. We're also coming to Excellent. Italy, I, I, I believe, and we'll that's gonna that's gonna it. happen. That's gonna happen in November 21. And uh, amazing! My birthday month. My birthday month. <laughs> I can have a, I can have a birthday, a birthday present. Thank you, my <laughs> birthday present. All right. <laughs> that's yeah. good. And um, how could you explain the sound of Creator during all these years? During all these years, well, yeah. uh, I, I like to think that there's a there's a progression all the time, and we're always looking for something new. Like, yeah. like that's always what you become most afraid of with with a with an older band like us. After doing so many albums together, mm -hmm. is to find a new angle and a new perspective for for every album, and that uh, is is the difficult part. But, but it's also the challenging part and, and the part that I like the most. And now that we have a new member in the band, Brett, he, 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 he brings a, a lot of, uh, lots of new ideas and a different, different angle. And, uh, and uh, it's fantastic. He's also an amazing guitar player. <laughs> That's amazing. There is a one album or song that could describe perfectly the sound of the band. Of Creator? Yes. Well, hmm. And well, we can say creator uh, slash Walter. I want to say. I want to uh, well, Walter. well, any, any. Uh, that that's that's a very difficult question. I, I don't believe there is one song like that because it's a continuous metamorphosis of trying to find new angles yeah. of, of of playing metal and, and thrash metal. So I, I wouldn't know how to answer that. No. <laughs> no maybe every every album is a different. <laughs> It's very different, uh, you know, time it, changing. It would be unfair to the other songs, no, wouldn't it? <laughs> <laughs> and about the Walter? What kind? Wow. Well, it's, it's, it, the music of Walter is very diverse. There's so many things yeah. going on. So, so I, uh, wow, what a question. That's, that's a difficult question. I couldn't really answer that. And I would rather leave it to somebody who, who is listening to the music than rather myself because I'm no, you so, to the yeah. fan would think uh, this is uh, I mean for yeah. me I will say all the time enemy of God uh, this is my my mantra forever <laughs> so, well it, it, it if you if you listen to enemy of God it gives you a pretty good idea of what creator is about for sure yeah. so so thank you for your opinion <laughs> <laughs> as a fan of course I answer it to myself to, the, to my question. Speaking about the contemporary scene, what do you think about the trash metal nowadays? There, there is some band that you like particularly, of the new bands coming out? Mm -hmm. Well, there's one in Finland that I like very much, they're called Lost Society. Yeah, I want to interview them too. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah, they're a great guy. Yeah, Sami Elbanna, his name is also Sami. If you've ever seen them live, they, they, uh, they have a tremendous energy on stage and, and uh, uh, they're really fun to watch on stage. You know, young guys and really, really good stuff. And uh, so many of the new thrash metal bands, uh, I don't know, we toured with a couple of them, like Warbringer or Evil, but they're all good. Bye. And, you know, it's, 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 uh, uh, Bad yes. Anymore. yes. They were amazing. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, so, so of course I support support people doing something like that. It's amazing. Yes. It's not the easiest way to do it, you know. Anytime we interview some new trash metal band and we ask which is your influences, of course, creator is always there. And now that we are interviewing their influence, <laughs> so I want to ask this: which are the influences of creator? What are the influences? Yes. Ah, uh, well, um, well, for a couple of days I didn't, for some reason, I do not know why, I listened to plenty of Celtic Frost, something Frost, <laughs> and we toured with them too. But I wouldn't, I wouldn't say it's an influence though, because it's more like contemporary people who, who, who uh, but, you know, uh, hmm, like music from, from horror films can, can be seen as an influence. That's good. That's amazing. That's a good answer. Uh, 
And yeah. it's, a, it's an innovative answer. And for you, mm -hmm. your, your musical influences, which are? My musical influences? Yes, for you. Oh, well, well I mean, it, it, it's, it varies, you know, I, I listen to all kinds of stuff sometimes. Well, if I think of Italy, for example, I always think of Ennio Morricone. <laughs> oh, the Kudu Rest in Peace, all is rest amazing, amazing soundtrack of the movie. He changes the movies. It was yeah. a good, yeah, yeah. Any of them. And then, the, of course, you know, metal bands, there's so many of them, there are no countless to even start naming, but... Um, I get influences from everywhere and sometimes I have phases, you know, like phases where I listen to certain type yeah. of music, like whatever, let it be 70s prog rock or whatever death metal. On Saturday I went to check out Vader here in Essen, they played in the church and it was a brilliant and show. And, Vader, uh, yeah, Vader, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So there's, there's so much, there's so much, it's hard to put your finger on it, really. <laughs> and there is, this is more specific. I want to ask it to you with if five album could be or album or songs or artists that influ that formed you as person as human being as a son as musician mm. or just human being Wow what a question what a deep question yeah. Well I mean I mean because I think in music with the music you can also know the, someone Mm -hmm. Try a little bit, not about the person and more. Yeah, well, if I go really back, really go back to my childhood, maybe it was Planets from Gustav Holst. Or maybe when I think of myself as a guitarist, it would be something from, from Barre. Uh, and, and if I think of myself as a, as a metal guy, it might be something from Maiden, like Power Slave or Killers. Or, and, and if I think of today, for the for the style of music I make, uh, well, Slayer was, I guess, at some point relevant and in, important, and, and and guitarists like Richie Blackmore or so. But that's all in the past. No, like, not, no. like, not anymore. No. That, that was like more the stuff that they did in the seventies and so on when they were younger. But uh, of course, there's still respect going for that that generation, of course, because they were the innovators and so on. Yeah, and so, everybody will ever listen to them. Mm, that's so. That's also a difficult question because there's so much music in the world, so much beautiful. Yes, and especially in the '70s, so many amazing, so many <laughs> legends that will live forever. From, <laughs> like you say, the the, the even from from Blackmore to Led Zeppelin, we can go through Janis Joplin, Jimmy. Ann, there are yeah, yeah. Uh, the music when everything started. A little bit before we were at Juni a little bit. There is some a lot of music I think can from someone. And uh, <laughs> coming back to creator, when Frederick, like the Fred, we say Frederick, joined the band as bass player, it brought some new ideas in the composing. Oh yes, for sure, and, and uh, he's doing that in the other room actually right now because we're staying <laughs> in an Airbnb here for a couple of weeks. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, uh, it's the best yes, way yes, to run. Yes, 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 he's for sure very creative, an excellent musician. It brings a very good vibe and, and an atmosphere That's to the band. That's amazing. This formation is really good. I saw it uh, <laughs> because I checked some pictures to you that, and it's a really good formation. And what about? I mean, um, do you think of the older member of Creator, the one before you joined them, or um, before he was there, you joined them? Well, uh, Tommy Fetterly, the guitarist before me, I met him a few times, he's a very cool guy, he's from Switzerland. He used to play in that band Coroner and, and they, uh, they did some comeback gigs at Hellfest and so on a couple of years ago is where we met him. I don't know him that well, but we get along very well. And then uh, Frank Blackfire, he, he lives here in, in Essen. I saw him at, at uh, our drummer's birthday party a couple of years ago, but, uh, but I don't know these people so well. You know. Just, yeah, you know, so of but, course. Uh, yeah, yeah, but yeah, yeah. Cool. So <laughs> <laughs> you before speak about some some other project you currently have. Mm -hmm. What about that? Oh well, like I mentioned, I was I was uh, playing along on the new Valtteri album. There was yeah. four song. There was four songs there, and 
And it's a while ago, we played also kind of an anniversary show for our album So Fine, but that's almost already a year ago. Well, there hasn't been so many shows around <laughs> lately anyway. And then, then Barren Earth, this, um, this death metal, progressive death metal band, it, it's, we're, still trying to, they, we're still trying to keep it alive. And we had our last show last October in Atlanta at the Proc Power Fest. And then just a few minutes ago, um, I have a musical endeavor with my wife also, Key Cobra Band, where I'm playing the bass. So I'm going to record wow. some bass for that today. <laughs> wow, this is beautiful. This is a beautiful way. And I, <laughs> I mean, we are arrived at the, the, the last questions. That we, I asked you something before about that, but in general, the, what could you say? What could you say about the 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 new album or the future plans in 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 general? Just in general. Oh yeah. Well, um, there's supposed to be one festival in Mexico, which I think yeah. might be might be cancelled already. The Monterey Metal Fest. I, 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 you know, at some point, at, at some point, they were telling us, yeah, it's going to happen and everything. But I'm not I'm not sure about that. Remains to be seen. But then then we have. Uh, in next next uh, April, we got uh, uh, Inferno Festival in in Norway, uh, which should be fun. And uh, yeah. there are there are a few festivals that are already booked for us for next summer, which I'm looking very much forward to them. Probably but, uh, we will see that in that some festival. <laughs> I'm looking uh, for some singer from the United States in different festival. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I hope so. And then, like I spoke earlier, the tour with Lamb of God is is coming up yeah. next next November, and that will be. Um, it's already announced. Check it out. Yeah. The creator creator website. There's a uh, good shows coming up, and and some some uh, some of the venue were were well, some of the venues were even uh, upgraded, which is uh, good news for us. That's amazing. That's yes. amazing. And and, uh, and 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 the new album. We're working on it, but I don't want to talk about it too much yet. There will be it will be a surprise. A surprise. Yes, it will exactly. be a surprise. That's, a, that's amazing. Uh, before saying goodbye, I just want to, if you want to leave a message to creator fans, voluntary <laughs> fans, the other band fans, and our followers. <laughs> well, to all of your followers uh, from Poisoned Rock, Italy, I. I, I really think that it's very important that you all people keep the music scene and the metal alive, especially especially during these during these hard times when there are yeah. not so many shows going on. But really, things are slowly coming back to normal again, and, and I believe they will. And I've noticed last Saturday how hungry people are for for uh, live music and metal. Yeah, and, there will yeah. be like all the crowd running to the first gigs available. I hope so. Yeah. <laughs> And for your fans, what would you say to them? Mm. To the fans, uh, well, we're, fans. well, we're working hard on on new music and more more to be told later. It's it's like uh, it's like we we really want to co go out and, and perform music for you all, and, and and can't wait for that. And we're just taking this time, uh, this time that we have now, if we want it or yeah. not, to to uh, to make the best kind of music that we possibly can as, as, for as sure mm. and the last things the that with me there is another guy that actually helped me to wrote most of the questions that i did it to you today because he's really huge fun we can say like uh, a bible of any type of metal but pro especially trash metal <laughs> his name is domenico if you just want to say just a greetings and message to him because he's really loves it's really rot of creator. It's a huge <laughs> fun of them. <laughs> well, well, Domenico, uh, thank you very much for your interest and in rock on, man. <laughs> okay, thank you, Sam. I mean, it was an honor interview one of my teenagers' band, and I'm really happy to that. And thank you for your time and your availability. I have to see you in November. I will be there for sure. Thank All you for right. for the present from my birthday. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So I hope to okay. see you soon, really, and take care. Greetings to all the band, and I hope to listen the the, the new album very soon. And 
good luck for anything uh, in, uh, the, in the next month. So oh. thank you very much and rock on always. Bye, <laughs> thank you, Ada. Have a great week, rest of the week, and thank you for Bye. your interest. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. <laughs>